Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the channel, y'all. Melanie and Gemini, Mrs. Tarot, back at you again with the message, y'all. Here's some of the messages I got. If you are doing something in it's and you know what I'm saying, like let's say you're in a partnership or a relationship, and let's say they don't believe in what you're doing, or however the situation may be, or whatever the situation may be, take it as it resonates and leave the rest. Y'all, what I'm getting from this situation is somebody's trying to sabotage you. But, you know, us Geminis, you can't sabotage Gemini because we already have a plan if the first plan didn't work out. So, y'all, moving forward. Like, um, some people didn't know that you was true to this and not new to this. You know what I'm saying? They thought that you had this random, you know, gullible naive energy of oh yeah yeah you know what i'm saying and it wasn't that like you know how to be stern and you know how to be approachable but what they can't approach you with now is that bullshit when y'all start seeing energy changes and less phone calls or less anything especially with um relationships like look y'all supposed to be focused on yourselves that's what i'm doing and when I feel like the focus is being taken off me and I'm supposed to be doing something that's greater good and being on my journey and it's not fitting, I leave it where it's at. I tell people, I will not talk to you. I will leave, like, come to my store and be on some, yeah, what's up? I'm trying to see, you know what I'm saying? No, I will not fuck with you because I already know what you about. I know what you about. I know what you about. I know what it is. And, like, I already get the energy out of people. Sometimes people can hide their energy and you don't even know what type of person it is but i'm telling you shape shifters get tired of being this trying to show you this person that they are not i'm telling you it's going to be weird shit that's happening to them because honestly i haven't just really ran into no shit i was i've been really focusing on me focusing on what i need to do for myself and god's been doing the rest god's been protecting me from whatever i know i had an energy of someone trying to do spell work on me um i kept waking up for two days at like four o'clock in the morning you know what i'm saying i was wondering why but then something about someone's trying to fuck with your chi somebody trying to fuck with your solar plex they're probably doing like the you know uh freezer spells where they put your name in the freezer and what they want to happen and have their intentions no it can't honestly you 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 not new to this they're trying to figure out their paths in their ways or they're trying i don't know what they're trying to do but you've been doing this like you have been ordained to do this you've been having like these these verses or you know uh these uh you know like you know spurts spurts disperse spurts like you have little like when you was young you was pure it's this thing that you did and saw that you couldn't explain so it's like you've been doing this. It's like being that you've gotten more into your spirituality. And it's been years, 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 years. Like, honestly, you've just been different since you've been born. Like, you normally don't have a lot of friends. And if you do, they don't last long. They don't stay long. And or if you do have a good friend, y'all vibe on a high level. However, y'all aren't getting the idea that some, you know, people want you to do good, you feel me? People want you to do good. People, you know, but if you doing good and they ain't got the million dollar home they ain't got thousand dollar you know what i'm saying um chocolate what you know what i'm just saying like the luxury shit and you got it they don't feel that you deserve it because they feel they should have been where you've been at or some i'm sorry but with some air sign energy and uh with some other energy, it's with all energy it's a natural mechanism to compete but you have to understand and know what you're competing for and who you're competing with you cannot do this buddha bop magic on people that's been doing this shit that knows how to protect themselves me i'm not gonna do no no love spells to make somebody fall in love i'm not gonna do no friendship spells for make a motherfucker be my friend i'm not gonna do none of that i'm gonna protect my energy and my temple and my money and my children and the things that god has given me that's why God gives us locks on doors and he give us 
codes on cards we need to have that with god you feel me we need to have that with god but y'all just stay aware because y'all can even have family members that want to see what you're doing they ain't talked to you in a while and da 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 you know what i'm saying and they coming back around to see what the fuck going on or they coming back around to see has anything they did work and it ain't and it hasn't and honestly at the end of the day i tell people play dumb play dumb and until it's time to drop them damn cards i'm telling you right now because people don't be realizing what the fuck they be doing they don't be knowing that you be working directly through god people have their own um what, what you call it people have their own beliefs but i know that it's it's god is real god we got we had to get here some type of way the moons and the universe and stuff had to been created some type of way all of that y'all moving forward 544 on the clock your you know what i'm saying the changes that you're going through is being protected can't no one touch what you got going through and then you started sacrificing and doing things y'all all of that y'all i know i'm like rubbing in my skin y'all this took me a spiritual bath and anointed myself you know with some oil some holy oil y'all i'm just saying y'all there's a lot of people that your know, mind probably playing playing tricks on you or somebody that you know didn't know that they had this type of competition in them to turn on friends or try to you know i'm getting this cinderella thing where she saw all these little rags everywhere and when she saw all these little rags and everything everywhere y'all and she put her dress together and they're like oh that's mine that's mine and they ripped the whole damn dress up and then guess what god did came in and she looked better than everybody at the goddamn thing but see god want to see if you if you are you here to do what you are here for or are you gonna give up i know i'm not here to give up and honestly today I have a lot of stuff I need to do, but I came on here late because I had to do a lot of um, book work, you know, as far as studying on some stuff, doing some things to get some things together, y'all. So I just be telling people, don't allow other people to get in your energy and try to manipulate your mind or manipulate you to think whatever they have in their head. Like, don't have them manipulate you in your mind to think that oh like they're they're literally like love bombing you family bombing you promise bombing you like whatever they bombing your ass they just you know, look whatever it is they bombing your ass and then when it's time to put actions where it's supposed to be it it ain't there and you like god dang like what the fuck is going on like i know damn well like i just I, and then you probably have just talked about it with somebody or talked about the situation with somebody whatever y'all and, and and you're like damn someone's saying damn what do we talked about this is not what we spoke on or a uh, order or something like that but y'all moving forward let's get into the message y'all i just want to get that out there be watchful of who you call your family and your friends and your relationships because i'm sorry sometimes mud is thicker than blood and 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 i'm saying like it's all and who fucking with you who god bringing to you that's gonna show you that shit because just because you've been around since i was yay high don't mean you still gonna be there when i'm nay high you know what i'm saying nay height your height they height whatever make it resonate y'all let's get into these messages y'all Thank you, God, Spirit, God, Archangels, and the ancestors for the messages. What do you need to know in this retrograde day? Y'all, where did that come from? Like, this thing just did its own little thing. Hold on. I think I got upside down. Y'all, this thing is. Y'all, what the fuck is going on? This thing is just really doing its own thing right now. Okay, it's good enough. Thank you, guys. Spirit got an arch angels. I don't know who was trying to stop that or didn't want me to do my reading, but someone don't like me doing my reading. Somebody didn't want me to do my reading, but we going to do it. And what I need to tell people is you can't compete and you, you need to get on a level with that person that you're competing with to go above. And that's why how you run in the waist. And some people will throw a rock out there just to trip you up to win. Like just to win. They'll do anything to win. I'm telling you. And, and some people are not as loving as you, caring as you, understanding as you. And they want to throw a, you know, a rock up under your shit for you to fall over. Running and runner. 
So somebody that um that is running is a runner. Or someone that stopped talking to you or someone that you wanted to be around and they started like you know veering away from you like they had other shit to do or hiding who you are or not telling people who you are whatever the situation may be because it's something within their self that they're incompetent about and i'm getting i've been getting a lot of energy of some people not being confident in their decisions confident in what they doing confident in their you know i'm saying the things that they got going on and i'm just saying y'all mad because you know your self-worth so somebody upset because you know your self-worth because if a motherfucker ain't gonna call you a motherfucker ain't gonna text you you're not gonna feed in that too long and someone gonna show you that all they want is money or someone gonna show you that you know what i'm saying all the in it for itself or you know what i'm saying they want to love bomb you so that they can get what they want and leave the fuck out look you left the fuck out first in being jealousy y'all I'm telling you, it's running, running. So something to do with, at first you was running in their energy, trying to see what they was about. Now you seeing the energy and you getting guys giving you these messages and you ain't even just fucking up with it, fucking with it at all. And then when you stop talking to them and stop being in their energy and stop hanging out and shit, they got mad and they was like, oh damn, how dare her just not talk to me. People don't know you have things going on, like you have energy going on. You have to, you know what I'm saying? You have projects, you have kids, you have a life. You don't have their life. They need to be living their life so that they can know what's going on in their life while you're living your life and becoming the greater good of humanity, which they are not. Moving forward, and being jealousy, y'all, and being jealousy, y'all, and being jealousy. Then I'm getting speak up or hold your peace. So either somebody was spoke up or, you know, something that I know, like me, when I'm get, when I get busy and I know I haven't been able to reach out to people, people know through what I got going on. You know what I'm saying? Just energy wise, you know, I'm a parent. I go to work. I do readings. I'm getting stuff prepared for things that I'm doing, y'all. Like, I, like y'all, like, my time be up. And people be like, damn, she be acting like she's too good to talk to me. No, I really be busy. And I be doing things for the greater good of the humanity, especially the Geminis. Hallelujah. Moving forward. So, um, someone needs to speak up. Somebody feeling some type of way. Somebody needs to talk to somebody or some type of way. This person already knows. or have, they, they think that you a fake ass high priestess or a fake ass person that has no intuition and you're dumb but then when like i say when it's time it ain't funny you know what i'm saying until that rabbit hole and the gun around this bitch investigation in progress so someone is getting down low somebody's getting challenged about somebody around them friends family members lovers and you need to move accordingly like real talk move accordingly heartbroken somebody's heartbroken somebody is envious and jealous and heartbroken because they can't be a part of something that they should have been 10 toes down for moving forward like people will give up real quick or one i'm getting the feeling that people are allowing other people to, to deter who you are like or or how you know what i'm saying or how you are they'll be like oh you wouldn't even shouldn't be around her first of all she ghetto or he ghetto, or, you know what I'm saying, they're not our kind, or you know what people be saying, you never know, they'll be trying to do something just to get over on you, and then some people fall for it, you know what I'm saying, they put some negative entity on them, and they fall for it, and I feel that they shouldn't, because honestly, they, they just, they just, they just, they mind is playing tricks on them, really, it's blank, and I'm getting exhaustion, Someone is exhausted from speaking up or somebody is exhausted and is fin to speak up, y'all. Moving forward, y'all. Thank you, guys, Spirit, God, and Archangels for the messages for my collective of feminized, y'all. Thank you, guys, Spirit, God, and Archangels. I'm getting jeepers, creepers, creeping. So there's an investigation going on. Somebody creeping. Somebody watching. Um, somebody watching your videos to see what you know. And I know it all. Trust me. I'm telling you, don't get into my energy and don't do weird stuff. Family, friends, groups of friends, envious people. I don't give a fuck. If you do that shit and you was in my energy 
and 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 and, and you think I'm not gonna know it? Don't know. I, I y'all, I I play dumb. I play dumb until I'm holding the gun and I have the control and I have the power, which I do. So I know I have the control and the power over my own fucking life. So with that being said, y'all, I feel somebody is feeling like that. Because, the, you know what I'm saying, somebody got heartbroken, they said, fuck that shit, they investigated the situation, everything started coming out after the fight, y'all, somebody heartbroken and fought, or uh, somebody is getting into fights, or somebody has so much going on, or got into a fight about shooting someone else, someone is exhausted, but they're being patient, someone's being patient with the relationship, friendship, family ship, uh, lover, Thank you, God, Spirit, God, and Archangels. I'm getting playing games, y'all. Somebody playing games. Somebody playing games. Somebody, like, you know, they'll, they'll tell you some weird shit that you know. Like, I promise you, I promise you I'll buy you some money if you do what I say. What the fuck? That don't even sound right. You can't buy currency unless you're trading it out. So, y'all, y'all, y'all see my hair going, y'all. Yeah, that's how real it is, for real. Yeah, it's down now. Moving forward, people can only do what you allow. So people can't play you and play games with you if you allow them to. Like, put it out there however you need to put it out there. But I know people can't play with me because I know what the fuck going on. I know people's intentions. I act like everything okay. Oh, mm hmm Because guess what? Even the devil has to obey God's orders. So whatever needs to be done will be done. Regardless. And then I'm getting mixed feelings leaving or going someone is has got mixed feelings of leaving a goal or being in a relationship being in a friendship being in a family ship like yeah i do yeah i don't yeah i do no i don't like they don't know and they and honestly me uh -uh. i sh i treat things with like, as a choice i don't treat things with options well i can do this i can do that i can do this no baby because ain't no one finna treat me like an option one thing i had a problem with when i was a kid like I try to not saying I try to, but then I was like, fuck that shit after after like a few meters. I'm like, man, I don't need to be around y'all. I'm finna go make me some money. I'm finna go work somewhere. Because you know what I'm saying? Even when I was in elementary school, they'll be like, Oh, you wait over here and we're gonna see if you can come into the group. I said, you know what? Y'all are not my friends because friends wouldn't do that and leave me outside the group to make me feel less than. So I'm getting the energy of someone may feel that you're high up here but you're the most kindest person but they feel like at the end of the day like they don't want you to go higher than them they don't want you to be better than them because they're gonna feel like the, the spotlight is off them but they don't want to be in the spotlight but they have the energy up they don't have the confidence to be in the spotlight i don't know y'all i don't know where all this somebody doing some sly actions they playing games y'all slaw ass actions and playing games a fight finna break out some heartbreak all over jealousy and envy y'all jealous in their um what what that is that c word is um covet someone is i'm telling you somebody is coveting something that you're doing somebody is coveting even, people can even covet your subscribers people can covet your views people can covet the money you have people can covet how clear your skin is people can covet that you have a house and they don't you know what i'm saying stuff like that people can covet that you have more than one income coming in and you can take care of your kids and you can do this this and this and still keep it pushing and moving then i'm getting a loyal person so someone's playing games with a loyal person who don't think nothing but good while this person thinking that you thinking bad but you're thinking good and your your mind and it's like their mind is on the wrong thing your mind is on the right thing for this retrograde. Their minds were on the wrong thing and they're getting their retrograde karma. You're getting the good retrograde. You haven't been touched. It's been little small things, but they've been able to get back. But loyal persons, someone's finna see something about if this person loyal or not. Like within this week or next week or by June, July, you're gonna see if this person's loyal or not. I'm telling you that real talk. Sit and talk and forgive. Somebody wants you to sit, talk, and forgive them, but they they keep doing things that they can't come back from. Over over giving and no reciprocation. They want you to sit, talk, and forgive, but they not finna give you nothing. They not finna show reciprocation. So what we finna do? Stay? No. And we're not <clears throat> love relationship. So this has something to do with the love relationship. This loyal person is tired of the fights. 
tired of the broken hearts, tired of the lies, tired of the envy. It can be with relationships, family ships, and honestly, when you get in shit like that, you can carry that in another relationship or a friendship if you have not healed out of another situation. You know what I'm saying? When you get out of a relationship, don't go and jump and be with friends because you gonna use those friends as security blankets and then when another man come you gonna leave them where they at i'm telling y'all that shit right now i seen it done it's been done to me they got you know what I'm saying they wasn't with their boyfriend no more whatever they broke up with their boyfriend or however and they we was chilling we were, everything was good everything was gucci then some random type of way when i was um living in arkansas she just got back with him. She started getting the same mindset, doing, you know, things that didn't amount up to her, you know what I'm saying, structure, her level, her, 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 her motive, you know what I'm saying, of operation, her M.O. And it just started, I had to leave her where she was at because I felt like it was, you know what I'm saying, I'm helping you. But then again, when I'm helping you, you got somebody over here helping you, but they're not helping you. They're actually help taking from you. Like, I need, I'd be telling people that, like, stop tolerating people. Like, you tolerating people that you're not supposed to be around or with. You're not supposed to be tolerating people lying to you. Tolerating doing this and doing that. If you want to continuously deal with that karma every retrograde over and over again, do so. But if you know what's your greater good and this person, and you're the person giving everything, paying for everything, all of this, and they can't give you no equality or come halfway with you, fuck them. Real talk. And then I'm getting want support. You can do the rest. So all you want to support, you can do the rest. You got the money. You got the opportunity. You know, you just want someone to support you. If they gonna be on your side in your corner, they gonna have to support you and show you that they gonna be here like you been here. You know what I'm saying? Like people got their own wicked ways, and that's why I be like, when you get out of a relationship, army and military. So some do all in and military, and some people, if they have trust issues in relationships and, and family they don't have trust issues in a friendship if people have never had real friends and none of that shit they don't know how to treat a real friend they don't know how to treat a friend that's going to be 10 toes down that's going to do this and do that a relationship with someone that you know what i'm saying i know i'm a good bitch i know i'm a good i know i'm good i know i'm a good person i'm a high priestess i'm an oracle i'm everything that you, i'm everything that you can name that's good in the oracle deck the tarot deck the book of knowledge anything i am that because it is what it is y'all then i'm getting complete liar y'all somebody is a complete liar somebody in this situation relationship family friends lover they're complete liars someone is lying to you all anything that you don't know but you're moving accordingly like you already had plans of something not panning out right and you had that plan b so really regardless of whatever happens it's still gonna get done like regardless it's gonna get done like that's why you was planning early see some people are used to people plan planning early and not planning early but planning late cutting once and checking once that they don't realize they fucking with a female or a dude that checks twice or checks four or five six times researches and then cut so when you dealing with someone i think they're gonna play in your energy play with your mind play with your soul play with your time guess what's finna happen they gonna be fucked up out here because they think that 23 23 on the clock they think they think you 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 got movement y'all y'all have movement and and they trying to move towards lying to try to stop something that you're doing stop your energy stop your money stop your thoughts stop, stop your creativity and it's not going to work y'all i'm telling y'all it's not going to work because god has his hand on it and you you keep on pushing through every day. I'm gonna fuck what you got going on. You still you do this. You, you take care of your situation, your responsibilities, your priorities, and then you still get into your projects. And that's what I'm proud of y'all for staying strong. God is gonna bless you in a minute because you've been staying down, sacrificing, doing what you need to do regardless of what anybody did or did for you. With someone trying to win it all costs y'all. Somebody lying. They're a complete liar. They're trying to win at all costs, y'all, but they don't know what they're doing. It's not going to win. It's not whatever's going on, whatever they're doing. It's not going to be a completion. Something is telling me you're one day short and one dollar less. So they may, I don't know, they're, 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 they're not like a full hundred, like they're a full 90, like we're the other 10%. Y'all, I don't know, but I'm getting something about at the bottom 
moving forward with or without. So trust and believe. We moving forward with or without. We have the plan. The plan is people just claim came into the plan. So if you're coming into the plan and the plan was already made and said and God already put it out there for it to be done and you just coming in, guess what that means? You're just helping with what God's plan was, y'all. So with that being said, y'all, pay attention, y'all. Pay attention to the lies. Pay attention to people's movements. Pay attention to these military people, these people that was in the military. Pay attention to these complete liars. Pay attention to these people that's finna try to win at all motherfucking costs, y'all. These people that's trying to win at all costs don't give a fuck about you. Don't give a fuck about me. They're gonna do whatever it takes for them to get to the top, to step on you to get to the top. Y'all tell me what's going on.